Welcome, welcome to part three of Oxenfree. Yeah, that rhymes. You know it. Oh snap, it's Jan. It's me, Jan. And uh, just like uh, I mentioned in part two, I'm going to do a quick recap of what has happened so far. So if you don't want any spoilers, go down to the description and click on part two if you haven't seen that yet. But if you, even ha if you haven't even seen like part one yet, I'll put it down in the description also. So I'll put one and two down there. I'll just stagger it as this goes along. But yeah, if you haven't seen those yet, please go check those out. And then, um, spoiler alert, I'm going to start now. So, where we last uh, left off was we had a hard time finding Clarissa. When we finally got her at Fort, Fort Miller, I think she was like the worst out of all of them. She got like possessed the worst. And uh, it was kind of was kind of creepy. And we finally concluded that it is ghosts. We definitely are dealing with ghosts, not aliens. Because I had a hard time figuring out uh, if it was one entity or the other. I, I really had no idea. But um, at one point, the possessing demon soul ghost thingy mentioned that uh, Mar uh, Maggie Adler or Margie Adler. I forgot what it is. It's, it was that uh, old lady that was mentioned at the beginning of the game that she lives on this island and she just recently passed away. She has a lot to do with what was going on. So... Um, on part two, we end up uh, gathering everybody together and we went to go find um, a key to unlock Miss um, Adler's mansion gate. And this is where we're going to lift off at. So let's check it out and see what we got. Jesus, that house is huge. That lady really knew how to live. It's like the chateau de adler how did she get so rich if she was just like a communications person or whatever in the military i think i said when we got here her family like owned part of the island or something i think she just inherited a lot honestly honestly yeah we already did this part at the end of part two but i'll just i'll play this again because of the fact that uh it's a good repeat of what's going on um good refresher it's not that bad again uh, these videos i want to keep it like an hour long so some of this part There's are something done. in here. Just looks like vacation slides or something. Check out the desk. Huh. Ren, you were right. There's like a ledger here. The Adler family does own the island. And here's a combination for a padlock to a chest is all it says. 29, 18, 54. A chest? Have you seen one yet? Uh, I don't think so. <sighs> Negative, but... Maybe I just missed it. But I know where it is from part she two. She made a lot of, what should I call these, slides? They're, they're not videos. Um, silent memories? All right, so we got, this is the, the, at Miss Adler's uh, mansion estate, whatever you want to call it. And we're hoping to take our boat and try to escape this island from this, the weirdness that's going on. And the idea was trying to make sure we gather oh. everybody together. Oh, it's like a... It's like a boat that needs keys. There are no oars. And before we go crazy, it's not... It wasn't with Maggie's stuff back at the office, like with the radio? No, we checked everything. Huh. Well, uh... What's plan B? Keys, they... They have to be in the house. For the movers or her family, you know? That's as Sometimes good Sometimes when I lock any. myself out of my house, I'll just... I can't help but just stare at the deadbolt trying to, like, hypnotize it to open or something. You ever do that? Um, not really, but we can try that now if you think it'll help. Yeah, at this very moment, we got Ren, Nona, all the way at the bottom. Jonah's stepbrother's always been, always been with her, so uh, definitely a new it's sibling. A radio lock. Getting to know the each other a little sure more. Woman sure to love her antiquated security. Okay, so I know <laughs> that we got a new radio earlier in part two, and we need to use this to unlock doors now. It unlocks doors apparently <laughs> I'm sorry if I'm a little uh, vague on everything um I'm trying to explain it all without like explaining too much to the point where it forces you guys to go watch the other videos <laughs> but anyways this has been a very good game I really like it part three right now we're gonna try to make it a little over an hour long I really don't know how many more I can do or need to do before we are finished I don't know how long this game is either so I don't know what the frequency is to unlock it. Did I miss it? Oh, hopefully I didn't miss it. Oh, oh, there you go, it's blue. You see how it's blue? That is a nifty gizmo. It is. Now we in. 
Finally. Carissa, oh, God, Jesus. you scared me. I thought you were like Maggie Whoa. Adler's dead body or uh -huh. something. How'd you get in here? How do you get in here? She was missing the whole the time from part two. Locked. Do you have like a radio? No, I don't have a radio. The kitchen window was open. Kitchen uh, window? Sure. Where? Okay, sure. Look, Clarissa's here. So everyone's here now. We can just... Everyone's okay, all right? That's a good yeah, thing. Yeah, let's just find the keys to the boat or a phone or whatever and just find a way home. I promise. We can all keep talking and or fighting at school on Monday. Fine. Okay, let's focus up. Everybody find something and hope that it helps. Yeah, I'm just searching around. I've, like I said, I've already done this part. This was near Wait, the end of part two. So. It's like a, a star map or a diagram of this planets or something. Yeah, why would she need anything like a map of the universe? I mean, it's not like she's bouncing stuff off satellites for a job. Or maybe they were back then. What do I know? Maybe they needed to chart uh, signals through space or something? Yeah, maybe. Oh, it's a, it's a draft of her letter that she left in the office. To whom it should concern. She left notes everywhere, she said. Hidden with secrets. Yeah, she did leave notes everywhere. So we have the whole group together. These are the five that we had at the very beginning, and we're still with them. We got everybody back together. Oh, you know, 140.1. Uh, I said at the end of part two that I was going to start doing that more. That's Adler's uh, station number, and this is what she's Good referring signals. to. She was an odd one, I'll give her that. But, this... you know, cool in a way. Maybe she was up to something. You ever think of that? I mean, she's wrapped up in this thing somehow. Well, maybe, but also things don't have to make sense. Sometimes stuff just happens, and that's the end of it. I'll pull the string. Oh, that's an attic? Yes. Thought it was like a cat's toy or something. Ah, uh, you want to come up? Oh, no, I'm going up there. Are you going to come with me or no? Okay. All right, so the chest. Ooh, you know what? This might be the um, the chest that takes that combination. It 29, is. 18, it is. 50, Spoiler, four. it is. It's a lot of radios and those containers we saw at the town office. Oh, and like a map of the caverns. She's written here, tune into the source. What do you think that means? She couldn't have known about the ghosts, right? Well, she must have figured it out, that there were ghosts here and the potential for them to be running amok. I guess that's a possibility. Is this, ah, the boat keys. Got them. Got them. Great, let's go, Perfect, let's get out of here. So this is where we left off at. We got the boat key, and uh, from here on out, All everything's right. new for me. got keys for the boat. Where? I got the keys. They were in the attic upstairs. In a chest. But who cares? Let's just go. Yeah, let's go. Let's get out of here. Oh, no. I knew it. Alex. Oh, Alex. I knew it. Come down here, please. I am. We have something we want to show you. Clarissa, what's going on? Clarissa get confused, possessed the most. You? Everybody's down. Hold well, on. you should be. How does it go? Things are different except in a different way. <laughs> Just come downstairs so we can get started. Yeah, she's being possessed. Clarissa is the one who Mona, is like the on, worst honey, possessed out of all of them. Over. Everybody had like a little like sequence of being possessed. But she has been the longest one. Again, she went missing for a while, and it wasn't until now that we found her, and she still have to be at the house that we were planning to go at. And... Ren, come on, we got a boat to catch, buddy. Yeah, they all they allow Cole. Let's see what Clarissa's up to. Again, uh, Clarissa and Alex, they don't really get along. Come on, Jonas, I, I really need you. Don't blank out on me now. Okay, I'm downstairs. So now what? You're over here somewhere. Ah, there, there you go. Are. Now we imagine you're a bit confused. But don't fret. This will be the final part of your training, Alex. All training. training is supervised by very skilled instructors. Training? I, I don't want to be trained. What are you signed, signed up for this, Alexandra? In the caverns, you tuned in to our signal. So please, I cannot bear your excuses, offspring. How was I meant to know what the hell was going to happen? And yet, without, without understanding, understanding your footing, you still acted. But don't worry. The test is easy. We will speak of something we see on the house, and you will go and find it. Okay. See? As simple and good humor as your mother's apple pie. Why all the games, What is though? it with you guys and all the, the games? You're like dogs or children. Just what is the point? The point, dear. The point is that they were never games. And you can figure that out by your lonesome. Alright. Now, let's start with a softball. I spy, with my little eye, radiation. 
There is, of course, a time limit here. So, ten. Radiation? Nine, eight. Seven. I don't know what the fuck six, radiation is. Five. One second. Oh, I'm sorry, child. You weren't even close. What's radiation? No, 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 no. Bring her back. Oh no, I'm fucking up bad. She said it was easy, but I don't. If you paid attention, you'd have noticed the television set right by my side, the little X-ray emitting death machine. Oh my goodness, radiation. Right now, you'd be wise to think of radiation. Other sense. Whatever. Pay attention. What are you even talking about? I spy with my little eye a notch. Let's make this a little harder, okay? Why is it upside down? Seven, a little knot. Six, I can't see. Five, four, three, two, one. Alexandra, what a disappointment what you turned out. Fuck, man. Don't just, just stop, please. Oh my Don't goodness, I am failing oh, terribly. Your new brother, gone to first light. It put me this upside down. Right here. Fast, right here. Portrait. The, the picture of, of, I guess it's Maggie Adler and somebody. That's a memory, Is this right? It? Yes, very nice. That's Margaret Adler and her friend Emma. You see, you and your schoolyard chums are experiencing, well, this has sort of happened before. Maggie and Emma tried to sport with us many years ago and, well, only this is so support. creepy, man. But in the process, we discovered a way for us to return, so to speak. It just takes a little time. And a far-reaching... Yeah, what happened to Anna if we mentioned her? Wait, what? What happened to Anna? Let's leave it at the poor girl didn't know what she was playing with. It doesn't matter. They're not an eternal recurrence. The waves. It's the waves, we think. And we'll use the waves to absorb into your friends so as sunlight blooms into flowers. And we will grow. And we will engulf. No! That's, that's horrible! We can see how this might seem. Gracious. But we're past the point of caring about that sort of thing. We tried it too quickly with Anna, but now we know. To wait and soak. We had to keep you here, on the island. It will be a great honor, Alex, really, to carry us through this life. And on to the next. There's gotta be another way. Oh damn it, I missed the click. Oh vessel touched on the rocks. We have until dawn. And so are you. We would spend our time wisely. And we thank you for your good service. So I'm kinda screwed. I don't know how to save these guys if I wanted to. Like, if I wanted to save them, I really don't know what's going on to be honest. Because I have a feeling because this is not the first time I fucked up in some kind of like test that they gave me. So if I continue to keep, you know, failing in all these tests, does that mean that like I can't save my people or myself? Or I'm stuck here to eternity or, you know, what if I end up being like Anna? That'd be terrible. Oh, you, I want to talk to you. Tell Michael he should go to school here. Okay, seriously, who are you? Yeah, I don't know. That's just a reflection of her. We're good. So we can go on. <laughs> I, I think I'm gonna be sick. Me first. Uh, it wasn't a dream or a vision or something. You and Clarissa standing in the living room just now, was it? Ugh. I wish it was. Uh, no. I wish it was a dream. Usually there's a lot more talking horses. Where's Clarissa? Oh, and by the way, next time, put some actual effort into the game. Pretty please. It felt like someone was shoving spiders down my throat. Yeah. Yeah, sorry, I'm I tried. Sorry, all right, I, I tried my best. I mean, when things are jumping all around, it's tough to even know what she was talking about. Yeah, it's true. So, I mean, Christ, if Clarissa was whisked away to the cave by nuclear submarine monsters, then, I mean, the plan has to be to retrieve her, right? 
I'm still going to call them ghosts, if that's okay. A ghost? Clarissa is only like one slice of the problem. We're all infected or whatever, so we need to rip the issue off like a bandage all at once. Okay, great, yeah. But how do we do that? Well, uh, a good question. Maggie? Ah, I think Maggie Adler might have had some sort of a plan or a, a scheme or something to fix what's going on. What possible plan could Maggie Adler have? First of all, she's dead. And second of all, she was like the island Mother Goose. She, she knew something. Yeah, she definitely I mean, knew something. Look around. This whole house is like a ghost hunting command center. And she thought she needed to tune a radio into the, the source of the problem in the cave. Well, if we're going to the cave... Oh, actually, I forgot. I saw the entrance has been caved in since you guys went inside. All right, I know there are a whole bunch of secret communist bomb-fearing tunnels dug into this place during the 1950s. And Maggie has loads of film about military stuff in her basement, so... Maybe there's a way back into the cave through one of those, you're thinking? <sighs> Let's take a look. Let's take a look. What kind of name is a Fippany Fields anyway? Wait, is it a Fippany? It's a Piffany Field. Oh, that makes more sense. Yeah, I was gonna say, uh, even I knew that, and I can't even read that well. <laughs> Alright, um, so we lost Clarissa again. I want to say 140.1. I'm going to make sure that I keep track of that. 140.1. There you go. I'm just going to walk around with that and see if I pick up something. Because that is uh, Maggie Adler's like radio station thingy. What, what are you guys waiting for? Let's go. Come on, let's move, guys. Figure out what the hell's going on. I really don't know when to use the radio when it when it's needed for 140.1. I just gonna keep it on and just run with it. Maybe that will help me with something. All right, there's already something in here. Experiments and findings of experienced phenomena, January 52. Awesome. Oh man, if this turns out to be just prehistoric home videos. Yeah. I'm sure this is just the uh, God. It's just the first thing. Just give it a second to warm up. I know, up, right? Will you? Jeez. Next slide. Space. You okay? We're getting warmer, I think. Oh, look so at that. Look if at you look that. at the, the like, lines or whatever, the bomb shelter should lead right into the cave, just like from another angle, according to this, at least. Oh, so it does. But won't it be like locked or something, right? Yeah. How do we get in? It's just like the cave wall, only steel or whatever bomb shelters are made out of. All right, next slide. Oh, what? She knew about these things? Wow, that's crazy. She did. It says that to fix a temporal tear, that's a mouthful, in the cave, we would need to transpose to the other side and tune into the source within itself. Okay, but we're not doing that, right? Good question. Yeah, that's, that's going a little above, above and beyond. Well, I don't know what to tell you, but strap in boys and girls, because we might have to, okay? If it's the only thing that will fix us. So we are on yeah, the other side, like the upside down world. Scary. I knew it. You know well, what? something better work. Or we're boned. Oh, or we're boned. Precisely. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. who's boning oh, who? Sorry, this is like this looks like the end, but from the from the wrong film thing. No, no, no. Wait, this is something I actually remember from that stupid radio tour thing because it like sounded so weird. It's called the call and response system. It unlocks the bomb shelter. This is showing us how to do it. See, Whoa. it says when someone sends an emergency signal from the Capard station in the woods and the receiving station confirms it. It's like a connected response thing. Uh, okay. Okay, any other ideas? That's interesting. Preferably ones that aren't unnecessarily complicated and obtuse and hanging by the thinnest spiderweb thread of relevancy. All right, then. All right, then. Alex and me will head through the woods, do the, um, call part. You and Ren can hang by the door to the bomb shelter and open it when it's ready. Wait, what are we doing? Wait, wait, I, um, I'm sorry, I kind of zoned out there for a second. What are we doing? Ren and Nona are team, um, Soaring Eagle, and you and I are Awesome Squad. Awesome oh, Squad. I want that one. And we're splitting up <laughs> to work on some old fangled machinery to open the bomb shelter, to get into the cave, to yada yada yada, save our lives or whatever. Okay, so use the response station to open bomb shelter. So it's right here. In the okay, we've been. Oh, you know what? I walked by that. I actually know where that is. So we good. We good. We'll do that. All right, let's do that. Game time. All right, break. And if anything goes wrong, please don't tell me. I won't want to know. 
Haha, <laughs> we won't. Ha, uh, we won't. I'm gonna keep my radio on at 140.1 maybe, like about here. Cause again, that's uh, Maggie Adler's uh, personal station. I don't really know what it is, but she was known to leave like messages and secrets throughout the island. And, and uh, apparently this is the best way to really pick it up. So, but yeah, I'm always gonna be with Jonas. Me playing as Alex. Who was on here? Nah, I should have back up here. And it, it seems like Clarissa always goes missing because she's the again, like I said, mentioned the most possessed. I think yeah, I'm going this way. Yeah, I'm going the right way. It should be this way. It makes yeah yeah. I have to go through the Epiphany Field, and then towards the bridge thingy. I forgot what it's called. But yeah, it's trippy, bro. Ooh, let's go. Alright, uh, no, no, keep it on. Oh no. Oh no, what's happening now? Oh no, Ren, are you drowning, bro? Are you drowning? Don't drown. Oh no, he is drowning. Alex, Alex, okay, are you, are you back to normal? I just saw, it, it, it was like a premonition, I think, and, and I know that sounds whatever, but this must be what it's like when people say they do that, because... I kind of just saw Ren drowning. Okay, okay, just take it easy for a second. You went all red-eyed, like when we get possessed. I did? I did? You stopped walking and started mumbling, and then your eyes lit up like Aaron little Aza, road flares. Lima, it only lasted like India, a minute, but we should hurry up and do this before the door on you opens any wider Tango. than. For the ships coming home. What about but turn on the the thing with Ren, Lima. it was so real. It was like it, I was there with him. Maybe we should go back. But I'm sure he's fine, so let's finish what we started. Alright, so the radio got it to work. Watch this. Turn on the Lima, Lima. India Golf Hotel Tango for the ships coming home. Turn, Turn on, on, on the, the light Lima, L India, I G Hotel H T. Tango. Turn on the light. For the ships coming home. Okay. Maybe that's clue. Turn on the Lima. All right, I think that's the only clue I got. So that's the first time I actually use uh, Adler's uh, radio station. And hopefully, we resolve something. I don't know uh, what else is going on. Let's see. Where were we at? Yeah. We're going to go this way. That's the bomb shelter. I don't know what direction that is. I'm pretty sure that's a bomb shelter. <laughs> no, look, it kind of made sense. Hey, guys. Uh, wait, did I get the plan wrong? Because if I got it right... No, you didn't get it wrong. You're supposed to be yellow brick roading it to the wood station right about now. We're just taking this way, that's all. What, the scenic route? Everything's the scenic route. There's no quicker way. Uh, okay, well, we'll be here. Good luck. Yeah, man, I'm pretty sure this is... Yeah, this is the best way, because... Yeah, this is the best way. What, what, is, what is he talking about? I didn't know if there was any shortcut that I'm not aware of. And if there was, then I completely missed it. I mean, we're gonna head towards, see, this is where we first appeared, so. If I remember correctly, we appeared there and then we went this direction. And that should be... The woods, yeah, the tiny woods, yep. Let's go! Let's go, Jonas, you're mad slow, bro. You know, if I was lost in the woods like that, I wouldn't be that far away from my buddies. I try to stay you as close as I can. 4 a.m. It's four in the morning, which is usually about the time everyone decides if they're going to bed or ordering another three pizzas. Yeah? What's your vote usually Pizza. in uh, that situation? Uh, never leave pizza on the table. It's like getting 11 in blackjack. Just double down. Don't even think about it. Oh, look at it. It's the couch. You right think there. this tuning into the tear thing's going to work? Uh, like, really? That's all we have. It really doesn't matter if I think it's going to work. It's sort of all we have, and we're... I think this... Um, stuff is getting pulled in from like their time or something. This is so weird. It really is. Um, yeah, it's not exactly a good omen. I think we're running out of runway here. Uh, yeah, that's right. I'm gonna leave you behind, Jonas. You're gonna fall. This is gonna be that one time somebody's gonna slip and fall. It explains a lot at the beginning towards why we saw a dresser in the middle of the cave. Start seeing all that stuff there. Yeah, bridge stand. That's what it's called. There you go. Ugh. Then we have to climb. I think we have to go all the way up to the top. 
Because I was there early in part one, and I didn't understand what was going on. But now I got the radio that unlocked doors. I think that's what's going to help me. Because it was locked before. Now the station's up at the top of the hill. I know. I was there. <sighs> I hope this works. Me too. Me too. This is creepy, man. If I got stuck in the upside down world. At least I got my friends. But even then, I'm, I wouldn't say I'm the chosen one. I got chosen because I was the one who activated the uh, the rip but at the same time me being a, i feel like it's more now the station's oh, up at goodness. the top of the hill i hope this works oh my <sighs> goodness god we're in another loop de loo they always come at the most appropriate times don't they <sighs> yeah they do thanks for the update oh what's gonna happen now now the station's up at the top of the hill i hope this works yep i am also <sighs> hope that Am I trapped? Am I supposed to like figure out puzzles to get out of this loop or just keep going up until I get out of the loop? Oh my goodness. There's no other way to get up there, so I gotta keep doing this. Gosh. There's gotta be a reason to get out of this loop. Let me, let me look around real quick. Uh, how are they here? They here? There you go. I knew it was something. Ren! Nona, what happened? What's wrong with Ren? Ren, he's... He had an accident. He... He died. Whoa. I couldn't... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh my god, Ren. I, I can't believe this. What happened? He... He drowned. He took a fall. I don't know. He just... He just stopped. I mean, does it really matter what happened? Yes, it does. Either way, done is done. I know you're not Jonas, so there's no use in pretending. Why is the Soon devil got here? It pretense. It'll be an absolute. Alex, we know you're in charge, and we know your plan, and we also know that your plan won't work. It never does. So we have a proposition for you. A deal. A bargain, really. Um... Proposition? Yeah, I want to know uh, like what, what you got on the table. It's already over with Paris, and she's gone. We'll pilot her through the rest of existence, and there's nothing you can do to change that. But if you agree to let us take her, let her go quietly and without fuss, we won't slaughter the rest of your friends, like young Reginald here. Uh, uh, we only... no, no, no way! I'm saving, I'm saving everyone. everyone. I know everyone she's a bitch. I need to save her too. We're all getting out of here. <sighs> Courage is not always the way, dear. Where are we going? I'm following you. You don't have much time left. Do you know how we know you don't have much time left? Uh, how do you hmm? know? Fine. Shoot. How do you know? We know because we can be Jonas for this long, and his soul is as quiet as an empty church. Just never say we didn't to provide you all the rules. Yo, these girls are mean. They're fucking torturing. Alright, where am I now? Okay. Let's go back down here real quick. I don't know which direction to go. I need to get out of this loop. Jonas is missing. I want to see if Ren is still dead down here. There's got to be something going on. There we go. I thought that's this tape over there. But I'm, let me go down. Oh, there's two of them. There's three of them. Adler's letter. Okay, I'll take that. She thinks that the ghosts were pushed out of our reality and maybe aren't actually dead? That's interesting. If you guys want to read this, go ahead. I'm not going to. You read it out loud because I'm terrible at reading. I'm going to skim through it real quickly. Yeah, but if you guys want to read it, just hit pause. <laughs> and I got this thing right here too. And this. Every time you see a rock, guys, we got to do this. This is kind of like a side thing, a little. I, I don't know if it counts towards anything, or if, even if it if it helps me for the story or not. But I figured, hey, you know what? We'll do it anyway if we catch one. Here you go. Watch. Boom. Easy. If indeed he find fault with anything or expose it with charity, the abbot shall discuss it prudently. Less perchance God has certainly 
control for this very thing. Hmm. Alright. Don't know what that means, but alright. We're gonna go back up here and try to fix all that stuff. I think that's Nona. I don't know who 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 that is. It's crouched down. I think it's Nona. I can't really tell. Who is that? Let's find out. But we wanna get out of this ripple. Yeah, I have no idea what that is. That looked like me, maybe? That is Nona. I know he was your best friend, Alex. I I'm sorry. I don't. I don't know what happened. One minute he was there, and then he was just. It's okay, Nona. You. You didn't do anything wrong. I know it's not your fault. Of course, it's not your fault. I didn't know him that well, but I like what I'd gotten to know. I'm sorry. It's. I shouldn't. It's colossally stupid of me to talk about him like that with you here. This is. He was more important. It's not stupid. It's not small to like somebody. It doesn't it doesn't diminish Maybe. anything. Maybe. It's a tiny thing, but I hope he knew that I liked him. No. And I don't know if he did. He hopes you did. I think that's enough. Like I said, it's a tiny thing. You should have said something earlier when I said when when Ren said that uh, he liked her. The station's up at the top of the... Ugh. God, that was... My mouth feels like I just ate a tree. You were possessed. And for the longest time, I think that we've um, seen so far. Yeah, I know. I can kind of remember that part. Oh, now you can start to remember Hello? stuff now? Oh. Anyone there? Wait, who said that? What? Are they... Oh, they're, um, they're somehow... I guess they're somehow broadcasting or something from the uh, station speakers. <laughs> Are you guys at the station? They're both alive. Anybody. That's all I care about. Jonas. God. Yeah. No. Jonas? That's a that's Punch a Alex to hear this. Punch Alex if you can hear this. Seriously, right in the throat. Oh my goodness. Jonas, don't listen. Right. Radio blocked. All set here for the, uh, the thing. That. The machinery. Okay. I just Beacon have to talk or whatever we're doing. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're trying to figure yeah, it out. Yeah, let's do it. Shut up. Time's wasted. Wait for the blue. Like Wait for the blue. Actually wasted. Like I feel my body wasting away. No, it, it's okay if you're like dealing with stuff. We had to deal with stuff. What stuff? The uh, when I almost kind of slipped and fell off the bridge. Ooh. Oh my god, you guys. No, no it was the. It was psychotic to watch. So there you go. Found it. Like, Almost doesn't quite describe go. the terror that held my heart watching the come All right. It wasn't that. You were perilously close to tumbling into the ocean from like. Hello. We're here. We made it. Hello. Oh, hello. This is Edward Island's emergency. How may I help you? If you're being sat on by a very large burglar, just mash the dial with your fist, please. Glad you're having fun, so man. So nice to hear you two finding the sunny creepy. side of all this. We are. Well, he is. We both are. Don't let her fool you. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, send a clue. All right. Signal verified. Shelter TF1 open. Nice. I guess it worked. Great. Okay, we'll meet you there. Right. See you at the shelter. Over and out. So now we go back to the shelter. So we walked all the way over here to turn it on to go back down. Oh my goodness. But yeah. It's definitely kind of interesting. I don't know. If my axe is gonna be the result of killing those. You guys ever played Until Dawn? Well, if you haven't, uh, spoiler alert, one of the biggest things about that game is your decision and your action may determine whether you can save everybody, some people, or no one at the end of the game. So it's kind of like, I feel like this is the situation right now because I'm not playing the games that well. This is not the first time the ghost has tested me in these games, and I think I've gotten like one right answer. <laughs> so I have a feeling that this may reflect on everything. And even though Clarissa is a bitch, I kind of want to save her too. I'm gonna try my best to save everybody. But if it shows difficulty that I can't save, like Clarissa, I might have to let her go. But that may pace, piss Nona off. And if it pissed Nona off, because that's her best friend, it, it might ruin stuff for, uh, 
I have an idea, Mr. Jordan. Oh my goodness. Couldn't we have him reborn? Oh no, come on, Jonas. Don't turn freaky now. Okay, okay, okay. I'm... Jesus Christ, I really What's hate down that. Here? But I'm... I think, um... It's getting worse, Jonas. The sun's coming up soon. I think we're running out of time. Ooh. Yeah. Um... I am in the right place. Okay. Right? Yeah. Yeah, I am. Look, it's scary, needless to say, when I, like, drown or whatever in my own body, and it's starting to feel like... Just, like, how do I say this? Because... It's okay, I Jonas. Just say what's on your brain. I just want to say... I, just, I think it would have been cool us living together for, for whatever, senior year. And I'm just glad I met you, that's all. I'm just glad we met. Aww. Oh, Jonas, you big sap. Okay, all right, that's all, nothing to see here. And now we can go back to the whole escaping and trying to live another day thing. All right, let's do it. All right, we're going to be fine. And we're going to be fine, by the way. There's no, you don't have to put it like, it would have been whatever to live together. We are going to live together, and you're someday soon going to eat all the peanut butter, and when I go make a sandwich, I'm going to be mad. <laughs> all right. You know what? She's definitely very welcoming for a new brother to her life because you know she did lose her brother in a tragic death and um you know she blamed herself for it and it's it's cool that she really like accepted him you know she, she's not giving him a hard time she's not like uh yeah giving him a hard time about you know you're not really a brother but you know she's treating him like another sibling she's not mean She's actually a very humble and nice person, which I think is quite interesting. I could have came down here, didn't I? What, does it matter? I don't know what down there it is. Oh my goodness. I really have no idea. I'm just going back the direction that I, I'm well known for. And that I understand. Because I came from this direction. Might as well go back the same way. It's 5 in the morning. Wow. Let's go. Okay, I'm, gonna, I'm just going to say one thing, and then I promise it'll be the last time I bring it up tonight. But... but you know you screwed up with Ashley at the concert, right? I mean, it's not a giant thing, but still. What concert? It wasn't... You can't call it a concert. It oh was like goodness. an all-day, all-night, like, festival with tents and, like, a hundred bands. I don't care if it had a million bands, Alex. Ashley had stolen her mom's car to go. And I know you say you didn't know that, which, whatever. But you still knew mom and dad had barred you from going. <sighs> Just tell me it's the last time I hear about you stealing a car. However inadvertently, my yeah. little heart can't handle the excitement. It'll be the last time, but maybe not for the reasons you think. I don't really care about the reasons, just so for my own sanity, don't do it anymore. All right, so what oh, are we doing? and I wanted to say, um, <laughs> per your advice, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna really, um, like, commit to Clarissa. <laughs> that sounds dumb, like I'm pinning her or something. Uh, commit? What the hell does that mean? You're in high school. <laughs> I know, I know. I sound like I'm 40, but I'm just, I don't know. It's gonna be, it's not gonna be casual anymore. It's gonna be a thing, a real thing. A That's real all. Thing, so huh? just get used to her. That's all I'm saying. No. Come on, let's get to the century before the last boat comes. I gotta get the uh, visual aid for the history project. And then I just gotta write the stupid essay. Ugh, Michael, come on. You're graduating in like three months. Shouldn't you be coasting? Hey, I am coasting. This just happened to be slightly fun. This is, it's just like a town history thing for civics, you know? So it's forced me to kind of, I don't know. And I mean, it's funny, I don't know if I even want to be here next year. It's just all so flat. Same people, the same expressions. Well, if you leave, I'd certainly miss you. Yeah, no, I'd miss you too. It's just that everybody here knows me, you know? I know you think I have it on easy street, but people looking at you all the time, wanting evidence that it's good, that they lived here, that good things can happen to people that are from here, it can get to be a real drag. Like, how about somebody else be captain of whatever for once? Give me a rest. You were, are great, though, and, and you're gonna be great whatever you do. I'm sure of it. You got spunk, kid. Yeah, well. <laughs> uh, let's head back before Karen Strands is here. You know, when we saw Uncle Pete last month, I wanted to ask him, because he, he got out moving to New York. And I asked him if it was hard leaving. Know what he said? Uh, no idea. Oh, God, Michael, I have no idea. I mean, knowing Uncle Peter, he was probably three sheets to the wind. He said the hardest part was deciding what to take with him and what to leave behind. I thought it was... 
I don't know, for him, <laughs> kind of almost touching. That's actually huh. interesting. That's actually, that's not bad. That is an interesting uh, thing <laughs> to say. I cannot believe I had to pick you up from the police station because of Grand Theft Auto. I mean, that is too funny. Hell yeah, man. <laughs> <sighs> yeah, yeah, whatever, man. Okay, now what happened? Now where are we at right now? Gosh, so much flashback. These ghosts are really messing with Alex. It's to the point where I can't even keep track anymore. That's why it's hard to keep up with Alex? Like, everything. Oh, stop my it. Just stop. Ugh. You got, you know, you went bad again. I couldn't get you out of it. We should really, we should get this done now. I saw, I saw Michael again. I just, <sighs> just don't say anything to them, okay? This is, it's hey. just. Secret secrets are no fun unless yeah, I you share know. with everyone. What is it? Reveal is yourselves. It? Reveal We're dating. We're dating. Nona and I. We're gonna date. Rin, dude, what did I just say? <laughs> what? They asked. Right? You asked. Mazel tov on the happy couple. <laughs> Thank you. That's good. That's no, good. Stop. It's one date at the Revival Theater. We're just gonna sit quietly in the dark and watch a documentary on Bosnian genocide. Hmm. Uh, Romantic. Cool. Uh, Cool. I'm guessing that this was Nona's idea. Hey, I gave him a choice. It was either this or volunteer at an animal shelter that only keeps frenzied possums. Anyways, I know it's stupid to be planning or whatever for this, but I don't know. I just feel like maybe it's not that insignificant or whatever. Whatever. Truly the language of love. Good. I'm glad. This is... I mean, at the very least, I'll get to hear embarrassing stories. So... I... I want to get this off my chest. Okay. Just, something happened to us tonight, Alex. Something broke. I don't know if it was the ghost or whatever, but you've been acting like not you. What? Ren. Me? No. I just, I don't know. Well, I'm sorry. I don't, I don't know what else to say, really. Am I the possessed I'm one? sorry. I don't know why I'm even saying this now. This is stupid, but can we, like, take a picture? Why? I don't know. In case things go bad and... Really? Now? Right before who knows what? Yeah, before who knows what. That's... That's like why I want to do it, I think. Come on, let's do it. Alright, that's not a bad idea, I guess. Just in all case right, we die. Just all in right, case we all in die. Just in case we all die. Where am I standing? Right here in the middle? You're not getting out. Selfie! <sighs> Alright. Well, not selfie. Group picture! Let's go. Once we're in there, the door won't open again since the system's so convoluted. So... Make sure you're ready to finish this before we go inside. I am. Let's go. <laughs> I'm ready to finish this. Let's go. Yep. Oh, actually, I can talk to all of them. Let's talk to them real quick. Under the bomber. Uh, hug. I am coming with you. You know. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I like this heart. You get to hug everybody. Oof. Okay. I. Uh, all right. Come on, Nona. I like you. Not your friend Clarissa. We'll but... be back. Oh, I know. Oh, best besties. This is a sweet game. It's creepy. It's cool. It has a little bit of everything. You know, I, I'm definitely... Oh. Oh, I like that. She's scared. That's probably why she wants to date him. <laughs> She's like, I never had a boyfriend in my life. I'm just going to date Ren. Oh, boy. <sighs> Listen, Alex, I don't want to say anything to Ren or Nona, but the truth of it is I'm not feeling too awesome right now. It's uh... kind of getting worse. No, no, come on, Jonas. We've we've cleaned the whole house. Nobody Jonas. wants to scrub the toilet, but it's got to be done. It's got to be done before we can fall on the couch and watch cartoons, okay? Man, something's going to happen, Hey, what Jonas. do you call a man who's short of time? Huh? Uh, no idea. Have you... Mm, no clue. Tim. You call him Tim. <sighs> oh, brother. It's... It feels like wrong to see one of these when we're not in a, a time loop, right? <laughs> yeah, it kind of does. It is. It's kind of weird. What's this? It's kind of spooky, right? The beds? This... Thinking they would have slept here while the rest of us burned? Yeah, but do you think it would even have worked? Like, if... If Yugoslavia or whoever dropped an A-bomb on it their heads... It would have worked. No, I think it would have worked. There's enough tons of concrete here to keep them from Ever fall out. out it think. works. It works out just fine. Ah, right, come on, look for it. Look for it. The soundtrack's so cool. 
definitely makes the game. Good music, good score. Love it. Where is that? Activate. Oh, there you go. Wait, before. Look, if something happens on the other side of this door, just don't be stupid. Cut and run, okay? If I turn into dead weight or start freaking out, just get to the boat. We're all getting out of to. here. Jonas, we're all getting out of here. I mean, look, we're about to fix this in two minutes. Two minutes. This is microwave popcorn of a problem. I'm not asking, I'm telling. Uh, shut up and help me. Okay, Mr. Dramatic, will you just shut up and help me with the door? No, we can't. Oh, wait, boy. wait, wait, wait. Okay, you know what? There's, there's like the tenth time we've heard this song all night. There is something going on with... No. Like, why would this specific tune be all over the place? I have to know what's yeah, going... Yeah, it, it's probably a trick, Jonas. The ghosts know we're closing in on, on booting them out, and they're throwing up distractions to distract you. Maybe you're right. Maybe you're right. But, I mean, it, it's ghosts. And I'm not about to throw away the possibility this is something else. I'll be fast, but it's just too strange. All right, I know what you're thinking, and Jonas, I'm sorry, but chances are remote that this is like your actual mom collect calling you from the grave or something. Yeah, but how remote, really? Don't talk to your mom, Jonas. It's like breaking or something. Can you, can you fix it? I mean, All right, I'll try. It's, it sounds like it's her, like a recording, or it's just, it's my mom. That's her voice in the static. You can hear that, right? I mean, I know you don't know what she sounded like, but you can hear that. The voice, right? I can kind of hear it. Is this it is not good. Do you th we do you were think warned it's earlier. I mean, we've been like talking with ghosts for the entire Jonas night. not to talk to his do mother. Do you think it's like it could be, right? It's just w with everything that's I don't happened, think it's her. Could have come I'm gonna here. say that. I, Jonas, I'm sorry, but I, I really don't think that's her. Like, really her. Well, how would you know? And I mean, you don't know that for sure. Well, I'm not saying I know that for sure, but from the stuff we've seen tonight, it just... This has to be possible, right? No. She's like so close. You can just... Can you just try and tune in the signal? This tape player thing isn't even... I have no clue what's going on, but... If you could just help me with this right now. Too dangerous. It's too dangerous, Jonas. It I'm is. Sorry, but I don't know what's going anything, on. Anyone. Too dangerous? We, I mean, you've been using that radio to do everything all night, like a Swiss army knife, like a spork, and suddenly this is too dangerous? Come on, I'm sorry, but please, can you try and understand what's happening here? Just please help me out. What do you want me to do? I just can't, just can't really get this to change, or... This is red. Uh, Maybe I gotta find it in the radio station? Mom, can you... Uh, this is not gonna be good. This may end up bad, because I was warned earlier not to contact Jonas' mom, but I guess I'm doing this now. I think this is part of the game. I re oh, come on. So many frequency. Oh, there you go. Mom? Whoa. Uh... Jonas, wait! Oh, I knew it. Jonas, where where did you go? Come back. Oh no. Are you over here? Oh boy, I don't know what happened. Did we just lose him? Did he die? Did his mom like kidnap him into the the other dimension or something like that? Oh goodness. And like I said, we were warned. But then again, we were warned by the same ghost that's possessing everybody. You know, the truth is, we could have left whenever we wanted. We weren't prisoners of the cave. Then just leave then. Why are you... Why are you still here? Why not move on of all of them? Because it's scary, that's why. Have you ever stared into nothing and moved with it and felt a part in it? It's worse than when we were wilting into atoms. Worse than... Dying. The first time. Yes. I have, actually. Oh, what? Sitting in your room breaking from your brother? You're like this one. Whatever you think you can do, you can't. We're not going back. We won't go back. Child, wait your turn. What the fuck? That's supposed to mean. Open the ripple. 
I'm gonna open that ripple. Oh, no. Come on. Ho hopefully we're not on time limit. Are we on something or do we keep going? There you go. I missed it. Is it right here? What, what happened? What happened? What happened? Oh boy. <sighs> We're gonna die. Hello? Somebody there? Guess not. I'm underwater. That's a submarine. So, what's going on now? You've come to close the hole. <laughs> Well, you're gonna find out it's not that simple. The horses have already left the barn. Where... where am I? Home. Your home. Soon, anyway. God, you're so spoiled, you don't even know the cost of things. <laughs> Closing the hole with your stupid toy will spare your... your friends from our bloom, sure. But it will seal you up in here with us. You'll die with us, again and again. So think long and hard about those friends. Wait, really? Why, why is that- Look around you, dear. You're on the wrong side of the tracks. Clearly. One last chance. You don't have to die. You can leave, you know, through the gate you opened. And we keep- The girl. Oh, they keep Calissa. Oh no! Oh, so I'm free to go? Oh, what do I want to do? Anyways. So make your choice. Quickly. While we still have patience to No! Try. No! What? We're gonna keep Clarissa. No way! I'm not- I'm not just gonna abandon Clarissa. Who do you think I am? Who do- Who do you think we are? Do you think we wanted to be thrown away? Like some faulty appliance? We won't let it end like that. There's somebody over here. How can I fix it then? Just- just tell me how to fix it. I'm here. I'm in the- the past, for God's sake. I can't change this somehow? No, you can't change. Before, you can't change anything. We can feel this binding. You have maybe just a few moments left. We feel terrible, we do, but- but you have to know why that everyone chose to forget about us. Everyone just shuttered us away. Maggie remembered. Maggie remembered. She wanted to help you. It, it was all she did was, was try and figure out what had happened. We've watched her in every timeline. Watched her try and understand. Out of guilt, maybe. Kevin, they, got, they didn't forget. Uh, she cared about you. Okay, here you go. All I know is she cared. She did care about you and the accident and, yes, what she did. You're a fool if you think that. I don't know. It won't hurt. We don't think. I feel the like. Change. Oh no. But we hope the trip was worth it. Seeing the depraved tourist trap they built on our carpus. Did you see the gift shop? You can buy a little submarine footrest if you fancy that sort of thing. This whole little community is for you. They built it up around Fort Milner, and for the soldiers that died, it's all about that. It's not for us. We've twisted our bodies, screeching two inches from your faces for you to, to see us. And we never do. Enjoy the scenery. Gets old after a while, believe Calvin. Us. To the crewman of the USS Canaloa named, um, Calvin. I, I'm going out on a limb here, man. I know you're in there. I know you're a person. I know you're all people. Come on, just please help me. Help my friends. Stop this. Calvin. Oh. Was our name ever? Calvin. Oh, Calvin. I almost remember. My name. Don't lose yourself. You were, were people once. Don't lose that part of you to be this. It's. It's. My name. Oh. Can I hug you? Can I come? Calvin you? Gilbert. It's hard to remember certain things. Our faces went a while ago, then our names. names. Our names. But our anger. Our anger is 
because we're afraid of all we have left. It's kind of the last stitch. It is not all. That's, that's not, not all. all. Okay, come on, come on, Jan. You know, that's not all you have. Uh oh. Keep it later. We keep ours. Maggie had, has, will have this friend, and you sort of remind us of her. Strange girl. Odd temper. Yeah, Calissa was an odd temper. Take care. With the time you have left, child, and take notice of what you choose to. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Did I save all my friends or did I fuck up? I oh my goodness. What? It's me. It says it's me. It's it says my name. It's me, Jan. Where am I supposed to go? Jonas! Jonas, where we'll go, Where we'll are go, you? We'll go to the right. Okay. Oh there we go. This is this is gonna be fine. Look Just at look at work through it. I see the reflection. Should I break up with Melissa? We should stay. Tell Michael to stay with Clarissa. They like each other a lot. But Michael's dead. How could I even? Whoa! Wait. What? What's happening? Hello. Are you? Look. Is someone there? Jonas. If you're still there, this would be a great time to say something. Oh my goodness, I'm on the other side. Uh, don't, let him talk to his mom. don't let Jonas talk to his mom. It's not good for him. His mom's dead. I know his mom's dead. What, what is. How, how is this possible? What's going on? Oh, I like this. I like this. I'm talking to myself. Well, that could have gone better. <sighs> right. Time loop. Tell Michael he should go out on his own. What does this? What does this matter? He's dead. He's not. He's not here. That what? She said to me. Oh my goodness! That was a test the whole time. I had to pay attention to what the reflection was saying to me when I was in the regular world. And I think that those responses was what I said. Oh my goodness! <gasps> what is this? What is going on? <laughs> oh, hey, I didn't even know you were home. You're always so quiet. It's like living with a little fairy tale mouse. Wait, did I get booted back in time? I know, I haven't used this desk in like a year, but dad has all his gear on the kitchen table, so I've been like struggling with the stupid speech, the graduation thing. I don't want it to be just the usual blah blah we've come so far type stuff. It should have like a point, right? It should bring you to your feet about something. Graduation speech, is that what we're talking about? Aw, oh, man, you haven't been listening at all. It's okay, this is really boring. I'm guessing Mom probably told you about my scholarship to state, right? I don't really know how I feel about it. I mean, I feel it's not like it's a bad thing. It's a good thing, obviously. Well, uh, what are you thinking? Engineering? Well, you said something about sports medicine one time. Yeah, I don't know about that anymore. It's just, you know, it seems like half the teachers are alumni, and... Actually, I'm about to be really arrogant and presumptuous and say mean things for no real reason other than I think I know better, so forget it. I've bored you enough. I'm say it. Me. Michael, say it. Come on, you can't take me to the water's edge of an idea here and then not jump in. That's just cruel. No, no, really. I'm talking out of my ass. It's fine. Listen, here's the... <sighs> you can't tell mom or dad. What happened? Clarissa and I are talking about just leaving. Getting an apartment somewhere and, and just doing our own thing, you know? Getting oh, wow, that's... That's exciting. This is like a huge deal, like like the boxcar children version of getting married. Or yeah, I was trying something. to be nice to him. Uh, it's yeah, it's kind of a big deal, I guess. It'll be a lot harder to break up, so there's some level of uh, vow there. She's been really pushing for it, wanting to look for places, and uh, I'm into the idea. I really am. I just I wouldn't feel right about it if I didn't have your like blessing first. I want to be nice. Uh... So can you just wave your hand over my head or something and say I'm all yeah, right to do this? Yeah, just do it. I... God, it's hard for me to say since I love you, of course, but you should do it. Totally. 
Even if it explodes in a nuclear war style breakup, you'll regret never trying. Thanks. Ooh, that means that's a, a lot. Good, that's good advice. Alex, just get good friends, okay? And when you're with those friends, just say yes to everything. And keep away from boys when you talk to them, it feels like you're performing. But also, stay away from girls who look you in the eye for too long. And match every beer with a water. And take classes outside of school. Classes you don't need. Michael, what is... Yeah. <laughs> what's this for? What, what are you doing? I know, right? This is just... This is a just-in-case package, okay? Just in case I'm not around. And I love you, and you're amazing, and that's it. So... I know I'm amazing. No! But soon, I shall be so I cannot remember any but the things that never happened. Yeah, I... I don't know. Hey, she's waking up. Is she all right? Did her... Is everyone all right? <sighs> Ouch. Is, um... <clears throat> is everyone doing all right? Still, um, yourselves? Yeah, I think we're all accounted for, right? Yeah, for the most part. Yeah, my arm fell asleep, Jonas but... carried you here. Yeah, 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 okay. The, the important thing is, whatever you did in the cave, it worked. The tear, the hole, it's fixed. The ghosts are gone. We're going home. Or at least they've... they've stopped trying to eat our souls. Yeah, it's important to note that. That's... I'm... I'm glad. I'm sorry. I'm just... I was back. I fell back a few years during the whole thing, and I just saw Michael again. That's all. So, I'm just a little rattled right now. You saw Mike? What happened? What... what was it like? Well, wait. Yeah, okay, relax, everybody. I was, I think, well, I know I was back. Um, it was like a week before he drowned. We came here, actually. We hiked in the woods, just spent the day together, and... I don't know, I was just there again. I'm sorry, Alex. Yeah, it's... I'm sure it was rough. It was good to see No, it was... Think about um, the good times. It was good to see him. It was good. He looked good. He looked... Um... Himself. I had my older sister. It was a night where... I don't even remember why she was mad at me. Probably something I said to our mom. But I don't know why that who cares night would visit. I wouldn't put much thought into it, Clarissa. Really. Yeah, it doesn't matter now. Maybe it's... I don't know, maybe it's like what matters to us showed up or something. The universe doesn't care about what matters to us. Then it doesn't matter anyway. No, I guess it doesn't. I can't believe everything that happened. I just... I feel like we should tell everyone we know. Like, go on a freaking book tour, but... I think we'd sound nuts, honestly. We would sound I, I nuts. Mean, it's not like... It's not like we have any proof any of this actually happened. Hey, is this your book? Oh, man. This is... We're gonna be the best couple ever. Uh, okay. Slow down. <laughs> I lost it on the way. I thought for sure some commuter would have just tossed it overboard. Hey, or... that reminds me. What were we... We were talking about something stupid right before Alex woke up. Prom? Uh, uh, prom. 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 I am definitely skipping this one. I'm deferring the crown to that wheelchair girl. Are you going, Alex? Are we supposed to still spike the punch or just bring in flasks? Maybe. I mean, do they even have I want to say punch? maybe. Uh, maybe? I don't know. If the urge strikes to cut a rug in front of that one janitor who leers all the time... Come on, come with me and Nona. We'll go dress shopping. It'll be fun. It'll be like a movie montage, except none of us are prostitutes and there's no rich guy. Sounds great. Uh, sounds great. Yeah, I mean, I guess I should be nice. spiffy up be once nice in to my life. She's actually being nice right, to you. don't say phrases like that while we're out and we'll be solid. <laughs> All right, you know what? It's picture time. Picture oh time. Oh my god, come on. Yeah, Nona. Let's do, yeah, yeah, let's do it. <sighs> yeah, I guess we should. Tonight's been, um, noteworthy. Noteworthy. That is a way to say it. Yeah, I'd probably say it another way. Let's, um, let's actually move outside so we can get the light. Sure. Ren, what is that book, anyway? I don't know. I can hardly make heads or tails out of what the hell he's talking about half the time. Here's good for the... yeah, just here. Do I stand right here? Where do I stand? Like, look. Like, this, here. When I was younger, I could remember anything, whether it happened or not. But soon, Clarissa, stand closer. I shall be so I cannot remember any but the things that never happened. Yeah, I... I don't know. Okay, everyone. All right, shut up. Cheese. Is that the end of the game? 
Well, at least I was able to save everybody. I think I, I must have convinced the ghost that is something worth living for. Oh, okay. See, I like that. That's sweet. Before we left, I told my mom I was spending the night at a friend's house. And when I got back, I didn't see any reason to change that story. And you know what? I still don't. The island did one good thing, forcing Ren and Nona together. Which is nice, because they're still together, actually. Though they go to different schools now. Trying out the long distance thing, I guess. You and 69 player brought... Oh! Okay, so we get graded for this. Clarissa left to study English literature. She was thinking of dropping out, but is keeping at it for now. We talk sometimes. Rarely, but sometimes. I hear she's scared of the ocean now. And she got a dog too, if you care. Oh, okay, so you and 50% of the play made up with Clarissa. Oh, wow. Okay, okay, okay. Jonas was the first to introduce me as his sister. You know, without the step part in front of it. And it was weird at first, but it's the truth. He's my brother. He goes to school in town, and we see each other a lot. You and 61% of the play bonded with your new stepbrother, Jonas. Hell yeah, we did. It's funny. What happened on the island used to pop into my head every single day. And then every other day. And then a week went by, and I realized... I hadn't thought about it at all. I guess that's... I don't know. It's good, I think. But anyways, I, um... Well... If it matters. I left town, I left town to go to school. Undeclared. That. I need time to figure out what I... What I want, I guess. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. I don't like that. But anyways... What time is it? <gasps> yeah, sorry, I gotta run or I'll miss the ferry. Ren's dragging me out to Edwards Island for that yearly beach party thing. And I have to pick up what's-his-name Jonas, too. Ugh, I hope he's not weird or mean or something. Whatever. I'm sure it'll be fun. It's something to do, right? Oh, no. I'm looping back to the beginning of the game. That's what's going on. It was a good ending, and then we're looping back to the beginning when... Ren, oh my goodness, that's pretty good. I like it. I like it a lot. This is a great game. Took me three parts to beat it, but you know what? I enjoyed every bit of it. It was it was difficult at first because I didn't really understand what was going on. The radio was really hard for me to comprehend, but this is good. This is very good. Well directed. Um, not overwhelming, but at the same time, it was trippy with the whole time lap. You keep looping over and over. I was really, really, really concerned when I kept uh, losing at all the ghost games, you know, where they kept asking me questions, I had to answer if to get it right. I just couldn't get it right at all. But, uh, I think I got a good ending. I'm not really sure if there's any other ending other than this. So, I'm definitely gonna find time on my own time to uh, see if there's any alternative ending. But looking at the score at the end, about like X amount of percentage that people would do seems to be. I don't know. I mean, I'm in the majority, I guess you could say. You know, I was able to get Nona and Ren together, made up with Clarissa, and, you know, bond with Jonas, and then clearly at the end of that video, it looped again. I don't know what's so significant about it. I kind of want to, like, spend some time on YouTube to see what other people say about it. <laughs> but this is my first play through it. I'm so glad I played this without watching anybody else's YouTube. I just heard that this game was great. I, threw I truly, truly, truly enjoy it. Soundtrack's great. Art is great. Production is great. Uh, the puzzle wasn't complicated, but I only think I, like, I got stumped once. But other than that, everything resolved with the whole radio frequency thing. But anyways, thank you so much for joining me. Thank you for sticking out. I know these videos are now long, and I made three parts of it, but it was worth it. I th it was awesome. I don't know what else I'm going to do, to be honest. Uh, but uh, just uh, subscribe to my channel and, and maybe hit the notification and check it out. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you don't, give it a thumbs down. I mainly stream, so you can find me at twitch.tv forward slash I-T-Z-M-E-Y-A-N. And uh, yeah, I'll catch you guys next time on a different game. Oh, snap is Yan. It's me, Yan. Catch you later. Wait a minute. Hold on a second. Continue timeline. What does that mean? What does continued timeline mean? It used to be a military base. 
Well, it used to be a ranching thing, then it was turned into an army thing, then it became a bird thing and a museum or whatever. Wait a minute. Henry Fonda stationed here, I think, for a bit. Unless he was Navy. Who's Henry Fonda? Around Christmas time, this little breakfast place used to sell these amazing polar bear sugar cookies. Man, those were good. And then one year they changed the formula or whatever and ruined it. So this is a new start, right? Alex? There's nothing different. Hey, still with us? But why would it say continue? You haven't said anything for Yeah, this is... Sorry, but this is so familiar. Like, I don't know, I feel like you've Ooh. said all this before. Well, yeah, I'm sure I've said it to you before, but it's new to Jonas, and he's downright enraptured. Right? Huh? Right. I think... So you all moved in? Um... Not, this second gameplay really. has to influence my first playthrough. And how did her mom meet your dad exactly? <laughs> they met on vacation in Orlando. He got lost in a... You know, actually, I'm not even going to tell this story. It's really not worth it. <laughs> okay. I know this. He already. got lost in some gardens, and he thought she worked there, and they hit it off. Yeah, that's, um... That's it. Yeah. Aw... Uh, that's so, downright adorable. Whoa, that was different. That was never a choice that my first playthrough. You guys playthrough. just met tonight? Yeah, I was, um... I'd been out of school, and the timing had just never worked out, so... And what does that make you to her, then? Hey, uh, second cousin? He's my stepbrother. <laughs> oh, yeah. I forgot that was even a thing. Well, at least you seem cool, right? Cool guy, cool hat. You get a cool new sibling living right in your house. Sharing your toothbrush. Wearing your clothes. No, that's the weird part. I mean, isn't it like... The concept of just getting a new sister, like a puppy, isn't it kind of awkward? <laughs> no, it's been totally bizarre. But just for the record, I don't consider you a pet. So, how do you two know each other? Oh, from way back when, like Paleozoic, grade school era. Young enough that I've seen her in a bathtub and it wasn't sexual at all. I mean, we both looked like little skinned potato... Ah! Why are you even talking about this? It's humorous, right? It's just interesting. The light I turns on this time? Interesting. I don't remember that last time. We'll I'll check under your seat to make sure you don't leave behind any grandchildren. All right. So I, I wanted to show you this part briefly because when I saw that continued timeline with a question mark, I thought it was just a different part. But like I mentioned, at the end of the game, it looped me back to the beginning, and I think I could replay it and continue on. I, it's possible that everything that was influenced from the first part can reflect on this one. I would continue this, but I'm only going to play the first part. If you guys want me to play a reloop of this uh, playthrough, let me know in the comments, and I'll definitely do it. But for now, I'm just going to leave this. This is the end of recording. This is it. This is the end of Oxenfree for now. I'll catch you guys later. Peace.